Hey everybody, Samantha McLean from Elite Agent Magazine coming to you from REA Group's headquarters in Sydney. We're here today to talk to their executive GM of residential real estate, Andrew Reckman, about a new tool that's been launched on realestate.com.au this week. It's an agent comparison tool. So we're going to have a bit of a chat to Andrew about how it works and how you can get the most out of it. So Andrew, thanks for joining us. I'm sure everyone's keen to learn more about this. Thank you, Rach. It's an early Christmas present for us, really. <laughs> this tool, as usual, comes out of a whole bunch of research that you guys do both from a vendor perspective and from an agent perspective so can you tell us a bit of the thinking behind the launch of the agent comparison tool? Well one thing we know for certain is that for almost half of all vendors the most stressful thing they face in selling their house is choosing the right agent and a lot of those vendors do want to go online and there are many options online but we will really take a principle in going into this of working closely with agents and with the industry to support them. And the first step is really to allow people to see data driven insights that allow the vendor to choose who's the right agent for them. So what were some of the things that agents were saying that they wanted to see from the tool? Yeah, a lot of the agents gave us the feedback. They don't want realestate.com.au to recommend an agent. That's not our business. Our business is to provide data and insights and let the consumer choose who's the right person to sell their property. Agents also want it to be fair and equitable. So they want a consumer to come and find the right information that's accurate and not to favour one agent over another. So we spent a lot of time making sure that the 700,000 vendors who are coming to our site will be able to find the right agent for them. Tell us what are the key changes that have been made to agent profiles and also to the realestate.com.au site in general. Yeah, absolutely. Agent profiles have been around for a while now and we know that one of the things that people like to do is to compare one agent to another. But previously they had to go from one profile to another. So we've actually done a couple of things. Firstly, we've taken find agents and put it front and centre of our homepage, making mm -hmm. it easier for vendors to actually right. look for an agent that's suitable for them. The first screen when you click into find agents is a list of agents and they're sorted simply by the number of properties that each agent has sold as the primary agent. You'll be able to click on individual agents who you're interested in and compare them. So you can compare two or three or up to 10 agents and see how they compare on key metrics. For example, how many houses have they sold in the last 12 months? What's their average medium price? What's the average time that they've been on our site? So how quickly are they moving that stock? Mm -hmm. And consumers can see side by side agents performance. And some consumers, they wanna know who sold the most. Others wanna know who sold it for the highest price. And others are interested in know who's moving the uh, properties fastest. So there's lots of insights that a consumer can control and decide who the right agent who is they for. Who they see. And is there anything else other than the number of properties sold that determines the order in which they're ranked? So the consumer can order it in whichever field they like. So the primary order, and we've uh, got feedback from the market, is to rank by the number of properties sold. That's the first way you want to order. But we'll be adding more and more fields to let people filter by the thing that's most important to them. So as I said, some people really want to know who's the biggest selling agent, but maybe it's the biggest selling agent in houses versus the biggest selling agent in apartments. Or alternatively, people want to know who's the person that's selling most of those high-end properties, mm. or who's best at selling properties at the lower end. So it really is up to the consumer to choose how they'd like to look at the agent listings. As I said at this outset, one of our key principles here is we're not gonna recommend which agent you should choose. We're just here to provide the facts and the data that we have on our site. I notice that there's no ability to add comments or anything like that, like consumers can't say you're good or you're bad. What was the thinking behind that and would that change in the future? Yeah, so at the moment, we just wanna represent the facts of what each agent has done. Certainly going forward, consumers tell us that they would like to hear test testimonials or hear rate C ratings of agents, but we want to get into that area carefully because there has been a lot of abuse of ratings and a mm -hmm. lot of abuse of testimonials. So that's something as we go forward, we do want to add those type of features, but we'll be careful about them. The starting point is to provide really clear information that's data driven, that's factual. Are offices going to be able to be compared or is it just based on the individual agents? A lot of principals actually call us and say, we'd like to search by office, but to start with, we're starting with agents. And the reason is that most consumers today who we survey tell us they want to know who's the agent, that individual person that's going to be selling their property. Mm -hmm. But of course, the role of offices is really important. So we're making a first step to compare agents, but we are going to be able to compare offices as well. You can search for office or search agency rather than search agent. So that option is there for consumers. But this new comparison tool is initially at the agent level. We'll later think about how we take that to the office level. And what about property management? I can't leave them out. We just held our uh, first customer strategy forum this week with property managers and that was one of the topics that came up. 
Clearly there is a desire to find people in property management as much as there is to actually manage the sale of your home. So again, we're starting with agents who are selling agents, comparing them, and we want to take that to offices. And obviously part of being an office is your property management division mm -hmm. and allowing people to see the relative capabilities of those property management groups. What advice can you give to really make sure that their profile stands out? We do definitely want to have agents filling in their agent profile. For example, one of the things that we include in the comparison is years of uh, service in the industry. And a lot of agents haven't gone into their agent profile and told us how many years they've been in the industry. A really simple thing. So the main advice we give to agents is ensure that all of your data is up to date on mm. realestate.com.au. It's very simple. You can log into your account, ask your office administrator to log into the account and make sure that all of your sold properties are in there, that all of the data is correct, that the number of years of experience you've had in the industry is there and that'll present you in the very best possible light when people are searching on the agent comparison tool. We'll be looking to add more and more features and functionality and also introduce an introduction service. So for those vendors who actually don't want to just come and do research on our site, we want to be able to introduce them to an agent and also provide the agent with a qualified lead. So that's something that we'll be looking to do throughout 2018. But importantly, we want to work really closely with the industry. Contact your account manager or ring our customer service team and give us feedback and we want to build this together with the industry. Andrew, thank you so much for your time. That's been really informative and of course if the guys have got any questions they can email us support at eliteagent.com.au and we'll make sure that those questions get answered. Thank you Andrew. Thank you very much and uh, Merry Christmas to you and everyone in the industry. Thank you so much.